General Hospital's Father for Thursday, April 25, predicts Johnson Jacks fell not to leave Sonny Current alone. That if Sonny's once again attack and threaten Jacks, he their life. Jason Morgan tried to prevent Jocelyn from doing anything harmful. Jason was afraid that Jocelyn just wanted to take the risk by confronting Sonny directly. But Jocelyn revealed that she had something that could put Sonny in jail. Jason wanted to know what it was and why Jocelyn had it, but Jocelyn kept quiet. At the same time, Jason also did not want his old boss to go to jail. Jason promised to protect Dex and Jocelyn well. So he said Stu didn't need to do anything else. At the same time, Jason also told Kali Spencer about what Jason said. Jason wants Jocelyn's mother to stop Jocelyn. Kali would think for a moment and may realize that the evidence that Jocelyn has is probably the flash memory card that was previously destroyed. Meanwhile, the fight after the fight with Jocelyn, Christina Corinto David would talk to Molly Lance and David. Christina does not believe that Sonny's was the one who wanted to kill Sarah's Renaud. Molly knows the truth because Molly is participating in the plan to send Sonny to prison. Any defend aside, the task to Molly and Sarah's reach out to Molly. Molly doesn't want to call Sonny as Molly on call. And also Christina's father. Molly temporarily did not tell Christina the truth because she was afraid that Christina would be agitated. Christina is currently the surrogate mother. The less trouble common to Christina, the better. Gregory Chase doesn't want to be in a hospital bed. When things get a little better, little Violet Fiend cried when she saw her grandfather previously condition. Perhaps Violet also knew that she was about to live Gregory forever, which made Violet shows off her different things. Her recent chase and Hamilton Fiend also shed tears. When Violet innocently asked Gregory if he was about to die, Chase and Fiend would know how to answer this question. So Brooklyn Quarterman would probably be the one to tell the lie. Louis Cerullo and Felicia Scorpio will also make a visit to Gregory. They will talk about good things and hope that Gregory will recover faster. Gregory also confirmed that he will appear at Chase and Brooklyn's wedding. But most people present believe that this was very unlikely to happen, since Gregory was almost a week to officiate the wedding. They had to consider a backup plan, but they won't tell Gregory because Gregory certainly won't agree. Sam McCall and Danny Morgan have face-to-face -face argument. Danny is angry because his mother is too controlling and interfering Danny's private life. Sam just wants to put his son on the right track, but to Danny it feels like a compulsion. Sam would tell Danny of a connery about what just happened, including that Danny wants to live with Jason. Danny will understand how Danny feels at the moment, and thinks that Sam is also a bit too strict. Drew Ken and Jordan Asford make a fuse move that could transcend their friendship. Drew almost flirted with Jordan. Despite the fact that 
there was someone there. Perhaps Curtis was also there, and Curtis was not happy, even though Curtis had divorced Jordan.